The conclusion of Starship's second orbital test flight hasn't dampened the ongoing excitement surrounding this groundbreaking endeavor. Now is the opportune moment to delve into the imminent upgrades and alterations SpaceX will undertake with Starship, particularly in the upcoming year of 2024. Forecasts indicate that 2024 will be an exceptionally bustling year for SpaceX. Served as a pivotal period, it'll lay the groundwork for crucial missions such as Artemis in the years that follow. Following the recent orbital test flight, SpaceX's blueprint for the upcoming year is becoming clearer, promising significant implications for the Starship project. What do these forthcoming plans entail, and how will they impact the trajectory of the Starship undertaking? Join us on today's episode of Great SpaceX as we uncover these critical insights. For SpaceX, each flight represents invaluable experience gained. The first orbital test flight of Starship stands as a quintessential example. Thanks to that flight, SpaceX identified numerous issues resulting in over a thousand modifications made to make significant strides in the last flight. Starship's IFT-2 flight will further this trajectory, serving as the foundation upon which SpaceX will rely to formulate new strategies. SpaceX currently has intentions for 140 four missions next year, marking an increase of 44 missions compared to the goal of 100 missions set for this year. Although Falcon 9 contributes significantly to this objective, there's a belief that Starship will gradually expand its influence on SpaceX's activities, especially following the recent flight. If all goes well with the vehicle and licensing procedures, SpaceX could potentially launch up to four or five Starship flights next year. This translates to a Starship flight every two and a half months in the upcoming year. This initiative aligns with the timetable for Starship's participation in the Artemis 3 mission, scheduled for around late 2025 or early 2026. Consequently, the focus for the next year revolves around accelerating flight testing to achieve the current essential objective, orbit. Subsequently, efforts will shift towards ensuring Starship is prepared for the critical lunar mission. Elon Musk recently announced the readiness of hardware for the IFT-3 flight. This signifies SpaceX's remarkably swift preparation, surpassing all expectations. The upcoming flight is anticipated to yield several noteworthy developments, building upon the successes of the second flight, establishing the groundwork and paving the way for successive launches. To align with these designs, ongoing prototypes are in various stages of completion. SpaceX currently possesses the S-26 prototype functioning as a tanker, while main prototypes include the S-28, 29, 30, and 31. It appears that S-32 has reached its final stack steps. Booster prototypes including B-10, B-11, B-12, and 13 are undergoing assembly, testing, or engine installation. Beyond vehicles, launch systems also play a vital role. Post the recent flight, the launch system remains predominantly in good condition, devoid of major issues. This is attributed to upgrades implemented over the previous seven months, notably the water deluge system. The only noticeable concern seems to be the slightly dislocated ship QD arm, which is expected to be resolved soon. However, considering the tight launch schedule next year, the lone launch system in Texas might not suffice. Therefore, SpaceX has developed an additional launch system in Florida. After years of delays, construction significantly accelerated by the end of 2021, surpassing initial estimations, including those of NASA. Earlier this year, SpaceX installed a Mechazilla arm on this launch tower, signifying the near completion of this system. In the upcoming year, SpaceX aims to complete final upgrades to ensure it is perpetually ready for Starship launch launches. This system will share the workload with the launch tower in Texas if SpaceX intends to conduct four or five Starship launches next year. Additionally, as it is built at NASA's Launch Center in Florida, it is primed to serve as the primary system for the HLS Starship launch mission to transport crew to the moon. Apart from these two systems, SpaceX might contemplate constructing a second orbital launch system at Starbase, Texas. 
Wars. Although these blueprints lack clarity presently due to the tight schedule for Starship next year and impending crucial missions in the following years, construction of this system could commence as early as 2024 if the plan materializes. Moreover, to guarantee the advancement of future missions, SpaceX will need to address many issues related to its vehicles. One primary concern remains centered around engine reliability. Prior to separation, all 33 engines functioned flawlessly, setting a new benchmark in the aerospace industry. Unfortunately, following Super Heavy's separation from Starship, the engines faced continuous failures. Engine issues thwarted boosters landing, leading to its destruction just half a minute post-separation. Acknowledging the improvements in engine performance since the first Starship flight, there's a pressing need for consistency throughout the entire flight. SpaceX must persist in enhancing its engines, even considering a complete overhaul. The recent revelation about developing engines that eliminate the need for heat shields is a significant stride. These upgraded engines are slated to deliver increased thrust, higher ISP, and various other enhancements, indispensable for sustained performance throughout an entire flight. Upcoming Starship prototypes necessitate upgrades, especially concerning a fuel leak that contributed to the recent flight's conclusion. Strengthening high-risk components such as fuel tanks, domes, and those proximal to the engines is imperative for both Booster and Starship to execute the entire mission successfully. SpaceX is also chartering the course for new iterations of Starship. Musk recently disclosed that the current prototypes represent the final models of Starship version 1. The version Version 2 prototypes are slated to be lighter, more reliable, and capable of accommodating greater fuel capacities. These upgrades are profoundly rational. Expanding fuel capacities will extend the duration of future flights, while reduced mass will optimize space for critical payloads like cargo, crews, and additional fuel. Above all, reliability will emerge as the key factor determining Starship's triumph, particularly in future crewed missions. Considering the planned launch of approximately four to five Starships next year, the existing number of prototypes may fall short. This necessity necessitates the prompt production of new Starship versions to fulfill upcoming tasks in the following years. A new version might be anticipated as early as 2024 to align with SpaceX's forthcoming endeavors. But no matter the change, some elements will certainly remain specifically the successes in the last flight. The primary accomplishment lies in the efficacy of the launch system. The recent flight, bolstered by the water deluge system, safeguarded the launch system and its adjacent infrastructure. Musk and SpaceX have confirmed that the water deluge system remains intact, requiring no repair or refurbishment. Furthermore, the surrounding infrastructure remained unscathed. These achievements stand out significantly, distinctly in comparison to previous flights. Consequently, irrespective of alterations to the Starship project, this system remains an important component, poised to play a fundamental role in future missions. Another notable victory revolves around the separation mechanism employing the hot staging method. This innovative mechanism facilitated a seamless separation between Starship and Super Heavy. Musk underscored the significance of this separation and the hot staging mechanism during the International Astronautical Congress in October. Musk emphasized the criticality of the separation process, citing it as the most precarious aspect of the flight. He further stated that if the engines ignite without self-destructing during staging, Starship stands a fair chance of reaching orbit. Given the successful debut of the hot staging mechanism, which effectively guided Starship through its most challenging phase, it's likely to remain an integral aspect retained for future missions, even amid potential updates or changes by SpaceX. The year 2024 is anticipated to bring forth various modifications and upgrades concerning Starship. Awaited updates, including specifics related to these aforementioned factors, are keenly anticipated in the forthcoming developments. Right now, we can gradually imagine an extremely exciting year of 2024 for the Starship initiative. The year 2023 has proven to be a period of accelerated progress and noteworthy milestones for both Starship and SpaceX, notably with the fruitful completion of two orbital test flights in
in April and November. Anticipations are high for an even more promising 2024. The year ahead promises further advancements in Starship production, continuous upgrades, rigorous testing, and an increased number of launches. SpaceX remains committed to laying the groundwork for the challenges that lie ahead. Given the rapid and robust pace of developments, it's essential to stay vigilant and tuned in for any new updates or developments concerning Starship. As 2023 draws to a close, let's savor its final moments and gear up with enthusiasm for yet another promising year on the horizon. And that's all folks, thank you so much for tuning in, and if you want to support our channel even further, you can hop on over to our Patreon through the link in the description below. Sign up and become a patron today to gain access to exclusive content. Sounds exciting, right? In any case, we still appreciate your generosity and your passion for space exploration. As always, this is Kevin from Great SpaceX, and until next time, keep looking up.